Good day, I'm Tennis, software engineer from Three Months, and I'm here to give you a quick rundown on the progress we've made on the T65 application so far. So to start off, the first challenge that we had was the ability to map business rules into a meaningful schema and this machine readable and relatively easy to add to. So that's what you can see here. <clears throat> We've grouped all our business rules under their perspective provider and then the business rule we have here and its associated requirements nested underneath it. While this is an oversimplification of the problem um, we are facing, it does prove that there is a way that we can input this and that it is relatively easy to understand and relatively easy to build upon. <clears throat> so for instance, in this current situation, um, we have about 40 business rules and we've implemented them from about six different agencies as a little test case. So what this does is it enables our application to read and sort through business rules, even though in a very simplified method. So it allows us to group them by a life event. So in our test application, we're currently focusing on events related to immigration, retirement, health, and childcare. And it allows us to query this data and visualize them. So if I go retired, I see a list of business rules that are available. I can drill down into them and see the related, um, the related dependencies for getting those or the requirements for accessing that service. And I can also toggle multiple life events to return multiple services. So this is at least a basic proof that this schema will be able to resolve, um, to deliver some sort of result. The second portion of what this enables us to do is, as you might have noticed, we have this first question here. So being able to query all these business rules according to life event also makes allows us to look up what's the most common question or requirement under these business rules. So if I take more than one, for instance, here you can see that the first question should, report, should look at the minimum age of the applicant. And it's currently um, the, a core requirement in four of the business rules, or eight or two. And this is dynamic, uh, easily queryable, and this is what we're starting to build up on now. So the idea being that the user will toggle, toggle their life event, they will see of the most important or the most common requirement as a question. Once they've sort of, uh, answered this, we'll save that as a small part of their personal profile locally and then loop through to the second most common, the third most common, and start excluding or visualizing which benefits uh, or business rules they have access to or may not have access to currently. Thank you very much.